So here is my Mazda. Ta-da! And I'm going to show you something really, really good while he's not looking, all right? Come with me. You coming? All right. He's not looking. Just want to explain to you guys why I've got a red nose. I'm going to be real, um, a reindeer, all right? Yeah, don't tell anyone. But if they ask, it's because I went out today and it was really hot. He had his roof down and it was so hot. Really, really, really hot. And I had my sunglasses. And this bit was the bit that basically just got the sun. So I just got a really bad nose. I got burnt arms as well. They're a bit red. So, um, yeah, so, uh, yeah, it's really, really fast. And, um, yeah, it's a Mazda. Great. No, I'm really just What's up guys, finally back. Uh, sorry for such a long delay in posting a new video, but with moving and everything that happened in the past nearly a year, I haven't had much time to do anything. Um, but I finally got another car. Uh, I've got my buddy Jay here with his car. I'm Say hi Jay. Jay. Hi Jay. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're just putting up another video just to sort of show off my car and Jay's car, because he's going to be in a lot more of the videos. Uh, and with like track days and stuff coming up. I haven't got a car. He's talking rubbish. Uh, so yeah, here's a bit of an unveil of my new car. Hope you enjoy. <laughs> When you guys out of the car park, that's why. Yeah, Roger, that. I, I think you guys heard what they said. Can you guys leave, leave the car park now, please? Okay. We'll yeah, thank you. Okay. We got kicked out. We got to go somewhere else. We just got kicked out of where we were by security, so I had to move on and find somewhere else. So we're now just standing on the side of a back road somewhere. But yeah, so that was my MX. Um, Icon Edition, Mark II, UK spec. Um, done a few little things to it, like the coilovers, exhaust intake, steering wheel, stuff like that. Still need wheels and a roll bar. Um, yeah, that's my new Mazda, guys. Hopefully you can get some videos of us tearing it up somewhere soon at like a drift event or something. So uh, yeah, let's now have a look at Jay's shitty little Mazda. Uh, tell us about your car, Jay. Um, got a Mazda, uh, 1.8 VVT. I bought it because I started working for myself, so I had to sell my Nissan, I had the S14. Um, and yeah, so no cool car, no drifting. So I needed something to keep me busy. So I bought one of these, come up cheap, and I thought I'd get it because it's cheap to run, cheap if I crash it, and just cheap to just do drifting in. I said I'd never, ever, 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 ever own a Mazda because I don't like them, and now I have one. Fantastic, great, Nissan for life. So I picked it up, it already had the dodgy over fenders on there, the ductile, the wheels, eight and a quarters with 30 mil hub centrics on. I had a back box and that was about it. So since I had it, I changed the steering wheel, put, the, put my Sparkos in, put the roll cage, uh, stainless steel manifold and downpipe and decap. Does pop some pretty cool flames and it sounds good. 
insert right here. Yeah, stick it there. Um, some other cool features on the car, come with me. So these here, you won't see any other Mazda with those, they are a very special part. Uh, therefore, when you're drag racing, so when you get to about 300, maybe 320 miles an hour, really keeps the thing uh, held to the floor. I also have these. They look like air fresheners, but they're not. They're actually disguised as secret technology. Um, when they, basically, when they start flapping, that's you know it's time to deploy your parachute and slow you down, because that is a warning that you are going too fast and you're going to die, and God's going to kill a kitten. Um, I also have this. It is a uh, duck towel, so the air. I mean, that might be a load of rubbish, but I suppose it just looks good. This is a dodgy um, bike rack. I don't know why it's on that there. Looks so gash. It does. Um, yeah, it looks really stupid, and I don't have a bike. And um, yeah, I don't wash it, and I don't care about it. We gotta do some big smoky burnouts. Yeah. See, look. See this door? That's how much I like Mazda's. Alright guys, I think we're going to call it that for a night, it's getting late, um, we want to go do a couple tunnel runs before we head home, a uh, massive tunnel up the street, stay tuned for that, um, I think we might go do a couple of smoky burnouts just to christen the first episode back on the channel in nearly a year, so yeah, stay tuned guys and we'll catch you on the next one. By burnout he means I'm going to set fire to both of the Mazdas, that's what he means by burnout. I hope not. Alright guys, we'll catch you on the next one. Peace.